it's Miss Sydney again. I'm ready to, to show you guys our at-home activity for today that you guys can do with your kids. This is my dog, Biggie. She's going to help me. Um, so today we're going to be doing a shape hunt around the house, and I'm going to show you how to do that real quick. So I have taken a piece of paper. Again, this does not have to be fancy. It's the back of a piece of mail, and I drew... Um, our five primary shapes that we talk about in preschool um, down the side. So I've got a circle, triangle, square, rectangle, and oval. And then I just drew lines in between them. And what your child's going to do is they're going to take this sheet around the house. Forgive my mess of my little classroom over here. Um, and they're going to take their pen or their marker or their crayon. And they're going to go around the house and find shapes. Um, and when they find them, they can put a little mark. So... Um, for example, I'm right here in my space and I already see a ton of shapes. I see my piano bench. Okay, that's a big rectangle. So I'm going to put a mark. It can be any kind of mark. They can make an X, their letter, a tally, whatever they want. Okay, so I found one rectangle. Here's a tape roll. That's a circle. So I'm going to make a mark right there. I'm over here with my letter sort. Here's another rectangle. So I can put a mark here. Letter O is shaped like an oval, so I can put a mark there. Um, so yeah, just take your kids around the house, see how many, um, how many shapes they can find around your home, and this is just some a fun way they can be moving and learning at the same time. So hope you guys have fun with that. As always, if you have questions about it, please text me or email me or call me, and I'm happy to help you um, in any way that I can. Um, I'm going to be coming back on in a few minutes to give you some updates on NAC ISD. So tune into that video as well if you're interested in those um, turn of events. Thanks so much, guys. I'll see you tomorrow.